Hello Internet, uh, my name is Mizufal, and basically what I do is I make Battlefield 3 videos and then I post them on the interwebs for your viewing pleasure. And today we're going to be talking about network smoothing factor. So what is this? Basically it's a slider that controls interpolation. Well, what is interpolation? That's a great question and I will quote NVIDIA here because they can say it a lot better than I can. So here we go. If an enemy soldier is running along in front of you, interpolation allows their movement to appear fluid, calculating their movement across the screen even though your computer is receiving periodic updates of where they actually are. So instead of seeing a person jerkily warping from point to point, you see smooth animated motion all the way along. By reducing the slider, you can reduce the amount of interpolation and in turn, potentially increase your accuracy by reducing latency. You're more likely to shoot at where someone actually is at at any time. The downside to reducing the slider is that uh, it may make character movements more jerky in the game. This depends on a range of factors including quality of quality and latency of your own connection to the server and those of other players. So basically what is on the screen right now is on the left is me playing uh crap I was going to say something. Oh right. On the left is me and I am playing with the network smoothing factor completely off, and on the right, the network smoothing factor is completely on. Now, I do not suggest doing that. Uh, we'll get to that why in a second. This is just for comparison purposes. So basically, what I would suggest doing to get the optimal settings is have it on full, as it is default, and then drop it to about halfway, play a little while, and if things are pretty smooth, you don't see much jerkiness, drop it down a little more, drop it down, drop it down, until eventually you start seeing um, jerkiness and whatnot, and then bring it back up and, you know, find find the sweet spot. Because what I found is, uh, when I found this, the my perfect spot, which is, if the bar is at 100%, take two-thirds of that off, and that's about where I'm at, and uh, it really helps a lot. There's there's always those deaths I used to get where it was, um, I'm getting shot and then I try to take cover behind a corner and I'm clearly behind the corner and yet somehow I still manage to die. That seems to have gone away or at least been cut down significantly. I feel like the, uh, when I'm getting hit, uh, the, I, I get a response much quicker. Like, I definitely have a, I feel like I have a little bit more time, um, to get to cover now. Um, and they, when I'm shooting someone and I get a little hit coins, they seem much more responsive. It's, it's hard to explain. I'd say everything just feels snappier overall once you find that spot. Um, and I would really highly suggest uh, checking this out. So anyway, I will link you guys uh, in the description to the uh, NVIDIA article explaining the whole situation on the network smoothing factor. And uh, anyway, sorry for the month months? Yeah, months, plural. Uh, long, undeserved hiatus. I really apologize about that. And I'm sorry this video seems rushed because I um, am just about to leave for vacation and I won't be back for two weeks, so don't expect anything for at least two and a half, three weeks. Um, but I, I'm positive I will make you guys more videos. So anyway, thank you all for subscribing and supporting me, and we'll see you all hopefully pretty soon. <laughs> see you.